We were in Italy one time in a house, and I'd bought a hundred cigars in London, Cuban cigars. And we both smoked cigars at the time, and perhaps we'd been there three weeks, and he says to me, there are 17 cigars left. And I knew what he meant straight away. He meant there's an odd number. So if he had a cigar, I had a cigar. Who would have the extra one? Because in Italy, you couldn't buy these Cuban cigars. So we'd have to go smoke cheaper ones. So I knew Henry was already planning to get the extra cigar because there was an odd number. And I felt I should have the extra cigar because I'd bought them. And Henry felt he should have the extra cigar because you couldn't get them in New York City where he was going to have to return. Well, in the end, he got the cigar, I do remember. We could spend a lot of time together, as I say, um, traveling, going. He'd go out of his way to look at things. And Henry wasn't that fond of exercise, meaning uh, it would walk around all the gardens uh, <clears throat> of a great big house if you had to, to get to something. Uh, but he wouldn't walk down 9th Street to the end of the road, really. He'd always wait for a taxi. But um, he didn't drive, for instance, Henry. He'd come here, meaning someone always drove him. Um, he never learned to drive because it would be better. Somebody, it means somebody else will always do the driving. Um, it also meant, mind you, we couldn't read maps. If you don't drive, you can't read maps either. So if you were driving with Henry and you relied on that, it was not too good.